So I'll just talk a little bit about the grazing that I've done here. This is a piece made in stoneware clay and white parts are stoneware glaze I use as blocks like a mattress grazing I've done. Initially it was dark clay with just white bits of glaze and I decided to put more colourful glazes on and I use glaze like an object so these are my Ardenway grazes, they're like blocks, sheets of it, I suppose. And I would place them on the pieces and in the kiln. Some will melt more than others, so these orange parts are staying more intact compared to reds and the greens. Um, and that's kind of how it follows its gravity, I guess. So I've been working a lot with painting and drawing, especially over lockdown. I've worked with different paints and different pencils. And, and the thing I like about painting actually is, is there's similarity with ceramics for me in the way that I can work in layers and work in different stages. So if I do something in painting, I'm not happy or something, then I can just come back the next day, start again or working on top of layers. I feel kind of a big connection between clay and paint and I'm out of my sort of semi-painting phase that I've started working with ceramics and the, what I've learned working with paint and canvas has fed back into my ceramics. So it's been a really fun thing to do. <laughs>